day, folks. Thank you for joining us here on Your Health. On today's program, we want to talk about olive leaf extract. Olive leaf is a source of tremendous antioxidants that are capable of reversing heart disease. This is really an amazing substance. Products of the olive, olive leaf extract. Please stay tuned for it. It's a great antibiotic too. St stay tuned for that. That's our show for today, olive leaf extract. But first, let's go to our news. Let's see what's happening in the health world. National health spending will surpass $10,000 per person in 2016. Researchers from the U.S. government report in Health Affairs that health care spending represents 18% of the total economy and it will grow to 20% by the year 2025. The report also finds Medicare will spend $12,000 per recipient in 2016. Health care spending is expected to grow by 5.8% a year, a pace 1.3% points faster than the general economy. Related research from the University of Sydney published by Lancet finds physical inactivity costs the world $67 billion in health care costs and lost productivity annually. The study is the first ever global estimate of the cost of the ever-increasing sedentary world. And finally, from the University of Cambridge, also published by Lancet, researchers find that one hour of moderate physical activity completely negates the health-eroding effect of sitting for eight hours or more a day. Well, folks, we have hit a landmark level of health care spending here in America. We now spend over $10,000 per American on health care for a whopping total of $3.2 trillion this year alone. The health care industry is now the number one employer in America, accounting for one in five jobs. And, folks, this is not a good thing. We spend more on health care than any country on earth, and yet we rank in the low 20s in both overall health and longevity, meaning there are about 27 other countries that spend less on health care than we do, and yet they are healthier and they live longer than we do on average. Now, the main reason for this pattern is that American medicine focuses almost exclusively on managing health emergencies and the symptomatic treatment of chronic disease. Very little focus on prevention and health maintenance or healing. Our second story reveals one of the reasons why we are in such poor health. We do not exercise enough, and the pattern costs the world economy a staggering $67 billion every year. In our final study, a review of 16 previous studies finds that just one hour of exercise daily is capable of completely reversing the health-damaging effect of sitting for eight or more hours a day at work or at home watching television. The study also found if you sit for eight hours a day for any reason, you are up to 60% more likely to die this year, and the health risk of prolonged sitting is equal to smoking or being extremely obese. So get up and get moving, even if it hurts a little, because exercise does a body good. Preterm infants fed more breast milk fare better later in life. Researchers from Brigham and Women's Hospital evaluated the health of 180 preterm infants over seven years. They found the preterm infants that received at least one half of their nutrition from breast milk during the first four weeks of life had larger brains, higher IQs, and better academic achievement and working memory, along with better motor function at seven years of age. The study evaluated babies born before 30 weeks of gestation. These babies are almost always cared for in the neonatal intensive care unit. They spend less time with mother and have fewer opportunities to breastfeed. The study was published in the Journal of Pediatrics. Related research from the University of Houston finds children who experience inadequate or disrupted sleep at ages 7 through 11 are at increased risk of depression and anxiety later in life. The study evaluated sleep patterns and emotional health in 50 kids. And finally, from injury prevention, researchers find when children under 6 are exposed to laundry detergent pods, they are four times more likely to require emergency room evaluation than when kids are exposed to other forms of laundry detergents. The study evaluated U.S. emergency room visits by children from 2011 to 2014. You know, folks, I think everyone has seen the TV advertisements or have used these new laundry detergent pods. They look neat. They make washing clothes easier, but small children often mistake them for candy. But when they bite into these pods, they get a toxic surprise that sends thousands to the emergency room for treatment. Now, this report finds that when children are exposed to laundry pods, about 70% of the time, they bite into the pod and swallow at least some detergent, causing injury. 
but when they are exposed to other forms of detergent, such as laundry powder or liquids, about 70% of the time it gets on their skin, causing a dermatitis, which is usually less serious than the damage caused by internal ingestion. Now, bottom line here, parents and grandparents, put the laundry pods out of reach of the little ones. Next, we learn that interrupted sleep for grade school kids leads to emotional disturbances such as depression and anxiety. The study found sleep-deprived children are less likely to seek out emotionally rewarding experiences. Signs of sleep-deprived kids include trouble waking up in the morning, being sleepy during the day, and a pattern of late bedtimes. At this age, kids need at least 10 hours of sleep. And our final study of the day shows yet again the best food for the earliest days of baby is mother's milk, even if they are preterm and in the neonatal intensive care. Higher IQ, larger brain, better academic performance later in life. And that's simply amazing, isn't it? Well, today on Your Health, we will discuss the health benefits of olive leaf extract. Stay tuned to learn more. You may have heard the saying, an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure. It's true. I'm Dr. Richard Becker. And I'm Cindy Becker. Autumn is a time of transition. It's the perfect time to renew your dedication to healthy living. This September, we're excited to bring you our fall savings celebration here at BioInnovations. Perhaps you've heard about the health benefits of supplements. In many cases, they can make a big difference. During September, Dr. Becker's spa nutrients are up to 40% off. Noni Natural Skin Care and Spa Therapy are 40% off. And Aloha Noni and Acai are still 50% off by the case. And you get free shipping with orders over $50 in the continental U.S. This is a good time to restart a program of nutrition, exercise, and supplements because an ounce of prevention really is worth a pound of cure. Order online or call 888-442-2128 and let BioInnovations assist you in making the right choices for better health. Ask about the AutoShip program for additional savings. Dr. Richard Becker and this is your health at a glance. Our health depends on the choices we make every day and few conditions are as dependent on our choices as diabetes. So here is your daily diabetic checklist. Number one, take your diet seriously every day. Eat lean protein and leafy vegetables. Number two, sugars and starches raise blood glucose, so reduce them in your diet. Number three, check your blood glucose and record the readings every day. Number four, take your medication daily and don't skip. And number five, try to exercise every day. It will help you take off weight, which will help your body regulate blood sugar better. If you are diabetic, this is your quick daily checklist that could make life better. For your health at a glance, I'm Dr. Richard Becker. Every day, about 200 million Americans do not get enough of a key essential mineral. That mineral is magnesium. The typical American diet does not supply enough. And magnesium is so important. It protects bones and helps more than 300 different enzymes in the human body perform efficiently. That's why BioNovations offers chelated magnesium capsules for oral use and topical magnesium gel to be applied to the skin. That's two forms of magnesium to meet your daily needs. Scientific evidence points to chelation as the best method of vitamin and mineral formulation. Order online at bioinnovations.net or call 888-442-2128 and let us assist you in making the right choices for better health. Because chances are you are one of the 200 million Americans who need more magnesium every day. Again, that number is 888-442-2128. Call today. Ask about the AutoShip program for additional savings. Welcome back, everyone. It's just fantastic to be with you today, and I hope everything is going wonderful wherever you are. Well, sit back and enjoy because today's show is going to be quite interesting. We're going to be talking all about the amazing herb, the olive leaf, all about olive leaf and nutrition. This is just fascinating. And Richard, what I like, one of the things that I like the best about studying the olive leaf and its significance is mm -hmm. the biblical history behind it. Absolutely. You know, the humans have been using products of the olive tree for hundreds and hundreds of years. It's been used as a symbol of peace, harmony, and victory. You know, the 
the victors would wear the uh, crown of olive leaves. The Egyptians used olive oil to mummify their pharaohs. The victors in uh, Greece wore crowns made of olive uh, branch. Uh, and humans have been eating the olive fruit for as long as they've recognized the tree. It's used in biblical times for anointing. The oil has been emblems of purification. And the olive tree has biblical importance. It's mentioned 80 times in the Bible. There's a theme that emerges. Olive trees were planted in the Garden of Gethsemane in Jerusalem, and Christ took refuge there in the final days before his crucifixion. He went there to gain strength, I think. What a peaceful place in the, the olive tree orchard and the, the high energy, the vibrational energy, the healing energy of the olive. I think it gave him some strength there. I don't know, but I would imagine that's a reason why. These trees live a long, long time. There are trees in the Garden of Gethsemane where Christ prayed and meditated that you could go stand by that today. Wouldn't that be an awesome experience? I hope I get to do that in my days on this earth. Uh, they have dated trees in uh, Crete that are at least 2,000 years old. So this is a fairly common phenomenon in cultures that were the first to grow the olive tree for its varied uses and not cut it down for firewood or to build something with the wood. They treasured these trees and, and they've kept them alive for thousands of years now. Today, olive trees are cultivated in many parts of the world where the weather is appropriate for it. South Africa, Australia, New Zealand, all through the Mediterranean, from Greece to Spain to you name it. And even California now, and that's a good thing because we need good American products that are healthy products like uh, the olive the olive leaf, the olive oil, and of course the fruit. It is still today a symbol of abundance, glory, wisdom, victory, peace, and hope. And I think you could use those words to describe olive leaf extract's ability to help us with our health. It gives us a sense of victory, peace, and hope. I'm also reminded of the story of Noah. Remember, he sent out three different birds. First was a raven. He didn't even come back. The second dove. And then finally, the third dove came back with the olive leaf. There is dry land. We have a chance to survive yet again. And this leaf proves that there's terra firma and we can return. But now that, if that's not hope, I don't know what is. Also called liquid gold, this olive oil, and it's a major component of the Mediterranean diet. And the olive leaf has been used as a fundamental medication throughout the Mediterranean for many, many years. The Mediterranean diet offers a host of health benefits that prolong life and improve health. Products of the olive tree play a key role in the Mediterranean diet. People talk about the grape all the time as part of the Mediterranean diet, and it is central. But the olive is just as important, olive oil is just as important, and the olive leaf contains the same types of antioxidants that the fruit of the olive tree has and the olive oil has. But here's the difference. The olive leaf extract has up to 10 times more antioxidants than the fruit or the oil, and none of the salt associated with the fruit. You know, I love olives. But each olive you take, it's packed full of salt, isn't it, honey? And it limits your ability. You know, if you have eight or ten of these uh, beautiful olives, all of a sudden you've gained two pounds in fluid retention due to the salt. It's a problem, isn't it? And for so many of us with heart conditions, we can't take all that salt. So olive leaf provides you with the antioxidants that the olive fruit has. It also provides you the antioxidants that the olive oil has. But what's the problem with olive oil? The oil has a lot of calories. So when we add more olive oil to our diet, which I recommend you should do, we have to cut something out. Well, maybe we have some of the olive oil, but we add the olive leaf to get all those good, powerful antioxidants without all the calories of the oil. I mean, it's just an idea of how we can manage this type of thing. Olive leaf contains between three to ten times the antioxidants that the olive fruit or the oil has. These antioxidants provide that slightly bitter astringent flavor that an olive may have. The more bitter the olive is, the more of the antioxidants you want. The olive leaf is quite bitter if you taste it. That's why we put it in a pill form as opposed to a tea or just taking the powder on food. It has a very bitter flavor, but that is the taste of these powerful antioxidants. Well, what about the science? We talked a little bit about the history of olive and all its, uh, the tree and the, the leaf and the, the oil and its many uses throughout history. There is a growing interest in the benefit of the olive leaf. 
For many years in the modern era now, the leaf has been considered a byproduct of olive oil and olive fruit production. Well, we have all these leaves, we have to prune the trees off when we harvest and they're just thrown into the trash pile. Well, let's look to history and the use of the olive leaf as a medicinal food to guide us in the future. And so scientists have begun to look at this byproduct of olive oil production, olive leaf, and are looking for the merit that we can use to help our health. And so in the last 10 years, we have over 20,000 new research projects that you can find. You can do this. Go to Google Scholar and research olive leaf extract and get the science on it. You'll see thousands of articles. It'll keep you busy for years. Now, I've been working on this topic for over 10 years now, and I've got a little head start on you. So I'll get you started. Where did all the science start? Well, the Pharmaceutical Journal, way back in 1827, carried a report during the Napoleonic era that showed olive leaf helped in severe cases of fever. That's all the way back to 1827, very start of the modern era. 1954, the same journal, Pharmaceutical Journal, reported British soldiers were given olive leaf as an anti-malarial remedy when they traveled to tropical regions. Quinine has since replaced that, but with quinine resistance, olive leaf is making a comeback for that varied use. In 1962, Italian researchers, they have a vested interest in olive trees, don't they? A lot of good olive oil comes from Italy. They isolated oleoropin from olive leaf. That's one of its primary antioxidants, and it discovered oleoropin from olive leaf lowers blood pressure. Well, this resulted in an explosion of knowledge, and today we know that olive leaf contains some 48 different compounds, 31 different polyphenols, of which oleoropin, hydroxytyrosyl, and olecanthal are the primary ones. But there are some 31 different polyphenols that make a symphony of antioxidants that can help us with our health conditions. If we look in the grand summary of olive leaf research, we find that it contains anti-cancer properties, heart protective properties, cardiovascular tree protective properties, brain protection, intestinal tract protection, liver protection. It helps to counter the damages of diabetes and obesity, and it helps to protect us from the collateral damage induced by radiation therapy or diagnostic tests. So we can use olive leaf to protect normal tissues when we get radiation therapy, say for breast cancer or for brain tumors. The olive leaf will help protect the normal tissues. We have an explosion of knowledge. Olive leaf is a byproduct of olive oil and olive fruit production. Let's use it for smart purposes. You know, one of the main reasons people have taken olive leaf for hundreds of years now, for literally thousands of years, is olive leaf is one of our absolute best antimicrobials. It's a natural antibiotic. In the 1960s, Upjohn began research. A big pharmaceutical company, Upjohn, found that olive leaf inhibited the growth of every virus they tested for. Now, they didn't test for all viruses, but it was a panel of like 60 different viruses, and it had effect against every single one they tested for, and a variety of bacteria and parasitic protozoa. Janai Medical College, Dental College in Pakistan, olive leaf is a potent inhibitor of a variety of pathogens like Staphylococcus, Salmonella, and Pseudomonas. Other research centers have found olive leaf is effective against gram-negative and gram-positive organisms. University of Arizona looking for uses of olive leaf in various forms of industry. Olive leaf is very effective in treating salad greens that end up on your table to prevent spoilage and contamination of these salad greens by um, salmonella, E. coli, and other uh, it's, it's actually sewage that gets into the water supply and on these ground growing plants, they're very susceptible to be contaminating with these uh, terrible germs that cause uh, infectious gastroenteritis. And they found olive leaf is very effective in preserving and preventing those infections and contamination of salad greens. We have more on the antibiotic properties of olive leaf when we return. Stay tuned, this is fascinating stuff. You may have heard the saying, an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure. It's true. I'm Dr. Richard Becker. 
And I'm Cindy Becker. Autumn is a time of transition. It's the perfect time to renew your dedication to healthy living. This September, we're excited to bring you our fall savings celebration here at BioInnovations. Perhaps you've heard about the health benefits of supplements. In many cases, they can make a big difference. During September, Dr. Becker Spa Nutrients are up to 40% off. Noni Natural Skin Care and Spa Therapy are 40% off. And Aloha Noni and Acai are still 50% off by the case. And you get free shipping with orders over $50 in the continental U.S. This is a good time to restart a program of nutrition, exercise, and supplements because an ounce of prevention really is worth a pound of cure. Order online or call 888-442-2128 and let BioInnovations assist you in making the right choices for better health. Ask about the AutoShip program for additional savings. I'm Dr. Richard Becker for your health at a glance. Do you have a family history of a certain disease? Scientists are discovering that our genetic code plays a smaller role than previously believed. Only about 20% of disease is tied to our innate genetic code. So what determines the other 80%? The answer may lie in the emerging field of epigenetics. What is it? Epigenetics is a group of changing factors responsible for both how our genes are read and how they are then applied throughout the rest of the body. And this may explain why identical twins with identical genes can have different health problems. Researchers believe two of the main factors in epigenetics are nutrition and environmental exposure to toxins. So eat a healthy diet, reduce toxin exposure, and you may improve your own epigenetics. For your health at a glance, I'm Dr. Richard Becker. Is your life out of balance? It may be. The average American consumes far too many omega-6s and not enough omega-3s. This creates an imbalance. So what can we do to get back in balance? We can eat a healthy diet. And most of us need to supplement with omega-3 rich fish oil. Fish oil contains omega-3s with DHA and EPA, fatty acids that promote good brain and heart health. So reduce omega-6 in your nutritional plan and boost omega-3 to get back in balance. To help you do that, BioInnovations offers two products, the Fish Oil Complex and Omega-369, both formulated for your health and well-being. So how do you choose? For highest levels of DHA and EPA, choose the Fish Oil Complex. For a balanced formula, choose the 369. Go online at bioinnovations.net or call 888-442-2128. Ask about the AutoShip program for additional savings. We're back, everyone, having a great discussion all about the olive leaf. Isn't this interesting? Well, Richard, you've got a few more yes. instances to, to share with everyone on the antimicrobial properties of olive leaf. Yeah, and this this uh, category uh, of knowledge on olive leaf is very important because people are always asking, isn't there a natural alternative to all these antibiotics? And, and isn't there something in nature that works against viruses? You know, we don't have very good antiviral medicines. There are a few, but we don't have any medicine that cures the cold. But we have nutritional plant extracts that help you nutritionally to fight these viruses. Uh, a study done reported by Virology, the medical journal Virology, tested 150 plants against rotavirus. This one's important because rotavirus is the number one cause of gastroenteritis, infectious diarrhea in infants. And it is responsible to up to half a million infant deaths worldwide every year. Half a million babies die because of this virus. Isn't that amazing? That's something we got to do something about. Well, they tested 150 different plants against rotavirus. Four plants worked well. And olive leaf extract was the most important of those, those four. They all had very good activity. Potent inhibitor of rotavirus. Multiple research centers. This means when you're sick with infectious gastroenteritis, take some olive leaf. It works. Combine it with your probiotics and your electrolyte replacing fluids. You know, the key to absorbing your electrolytes when your intestinal tract is inflamed is a small dose of glucose. You need a little glucose to absorb sodium back so you can get your strength back. You don't need heavy, high fructose corn syrup laden athletic replenishing drinks. It's too much sugar. It actually pulls fluid from your vascular tree into your gut and makes your situation worse. You want just a touch of sugar, just a touch. 
that with a little all leaf, you're, you're going to make progress. Multiple research centers have now shown all of leaf is effective against influenza, cold viruses, hepatitis B virus, Epstein-Barr virus, herpes simplex virus, and then the bacteria like Staphylococcus aureus and the methicillin-resistant Staph aureus. You know, you combine olive leaf and oil of oregano, that MRSA is done. Topically, systemically, any way you can do it, this stuff works. It does. I'm thinking of someone who's maybe had a bone infection. They were in a major traumatic injury. And they had multiple surgeries and they had broken bones that had to be reduced surgically. And then they got an infection because you're so wiped out. You've been in the hospital for two months and you've been on three months of antibiotics now and you still have bone infection. Go to this stuff. It works, folks. You can take it with the antibiotics too. Olive leaf with probiotics and a little oil of oregano. If your doctor wants you to be on the antibiotics, continue it on. That's fine. But eventually you're going to find that it's this stuff that cures those resistant organisms. What else? Leishmaniasis, H. pylori. Having trouble getting over H. pylori? Olive leaf has good activity. Add it next time. Next time you go in and get all that regimen with the antibiotics, the acid suppressing, add probiotics and olive leaf extract, and you're going to make progress this time. You're going to do it. Campylobacter, one of the most common causes of contagious gastroenteritis, flu bug, acanthamoeba, encephalitis, very serious. It has activity even against that. You know, the ancients tried everything oftentimes in desperation to save their loved ones. This is how you learn this knowledge. Well, you know, when we took that olive leaf, we stopped the epidemic. That is a special plant. It will be revered. That's how you get this reputation. Next, tuberculosis, activity against added to your tuberculosis regimen, urinary tract infections. You want to break that cycle, a, a little cranberry extract, a little olive leaf, a little vitamin C, more water, you know, You've seen our program on how to handle these chronic urinary tract infections. This is how we do it. Dental infections. It's even being used experimentally with HIV treatment with good results. It's part of the HIV treatment. Hydroxytyrosyl is also a potent anti-yeast. I say probably the most common that we get requests for for last. Chronic yeast infections. Multiple antibiotics. Now I've got the yeast syndrome. Over and over, I feel bad. I'm worn out. I got headaches and my eyes burn and I'm fatigued and I got the yeast. One over after another. Isn't there an end to this? Yes, olive leaf will help you do the anti Oxidant hydroxytyrosyl, which is part of olive leaf extract, is a potent anti-yeast agent. And they've been able to prove that it disrupts the germ tube inhibition of the multiple strains of candida. You know, you get a little spore, a little bud. That's the yeast bud. And then when it meets a suitable medium in which to grow, like your intestinal tract, it buds and it starts to grow like a root. That's called a hyphae. What olive leaf does is it disrupts the cell membrane so it can't live. It has to have a barrier to create an electrical potential difference that is what we call life. It destroys that. Penicillin does that too in, in, in bacteria, but not in, in yeast. So we have a medication, so to speak now, a food extract that nutritionally treats these yeast. And it's very effective. And there's no evidence of resistance yet. Isn't that the amazing thing? You know, everything man makes, nature figures out how to combat it. You know, penicillin used to cure almost every germ you could think of. Not anymore. You know that. We're all aware of that. But here we have olive leaf. It's been used as an antibiotic for hundreds of years now and still no resistance. See, those are the questions I want to ask. How'd you figure that out? Just amazing. Well, our next category, oh, one more, Listeria monocytogens biofilms. This is an important and emerging concept because it's one of the reasons for heart disease. It's also a reason why we get dental caries, cavities. It's also a reason why prosthetic devices, say you have a new knee joint put in, but it becomes infected and they can't clear the infection out. It's because these germs create biofilms. It's one of the main reasons why food producers have a problem with contamination of their uh, uh, food producing equipment and, it, and then the product goes out to the public and things cause food poisoning that never did in the past. Peanut butter. Who would ever think peanut butter would carry salmonella? Well, it's because these germs create a film. It's like a shellac on the food producing equipment that's scrubbing 
and uh, of, of soaps don't get rid of. Well, guess what? They figured out that olive leaf extract prevents the formation of these biofilms. This is one of the industrial uses of the byproduct of making olive oil. They're finding for olive leaf. Mix it in with the food product a little bit, and it, a little is enough to prevent the biofilm formation in the food producing equipment, keeping our food supply safe. All from olive leaf. Isn't that amazing? It just shows you the power that's in these natural agents. Now, we're headed to a break here. But perhaps one of the most impressive features of olive leaf is its antioxidant abilities. This is what keeps us young and disease-free for years to come. This one's fascinating. We'll be right back. You may have heard the saying, an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure. It's true. I'm Dr. Richard Becker. And I'm Cindy Becker. Autumn is a time of transition. It's the perfect time to renew your dedication to healthy living. This September, we're excited to bring you our fall savings celebration here at BioInnovations. Perhaps you've heard about the health benefits of supplements. In many cases, they can make a big difference. During September, Dr. Becker Spa Nutrients are up to 40% off. Noni Natural Skin Care and Spa Therapy are 40% off. And Aloha Noni and Acai are still 50% off by the case. And you get free shipping with orders over $50 in the continental U.S. This is a good time to restart a program of nutrition, exercise, and supplements because an ounce of prevention really is worth a pound of cure. Order online or call 888-442-2128 and let BioInnovations assist you in making the right choices for better health. Ask about the AutoShip program for additional savings. I'm Cindy Becker, and this is Your Health at a Glance. Do you want to maintain your mental clarity? With people living longer, we need more research into the ways to lower the risk of dementia. Studies are showing us that people who regularly read books, complete puzzles, or solve word games like the Sunday crossword puzzle maintain their mental abilities longer than people who don't. We also preserve memory by maintaining social activities, such as volunteering, attending religious services, or regularly talking with friends and neighbors. And diet plays a big role as well. It's important to eat a nutritious diet, free from heavy metals and chemical pollutants, and full of vitamins and the essential fatty acids which power the brain. These simple and important steps will help keep you mentally healthy for many years to come. For your health at a glance, I'm Cindy Becker. There are thousands of fungal species, and at least 200 of them have been found to cause human diseases. Fungal infections are common, so what can we do to protect ourselves? One solution is oregano, a natural alternative. Oregano fights problems created by fungus and yeast overgrowth, and it improves many other health conditions. At BioInnovations, we offer oregano in gel caps and liquid extract. Yeast and fungal disorders can improve. So take charge of your health by choosing a natural alternative such as oregano gel caps or oil of oregano liquid extract. Order online at BioInnovations.net or call 888-442-2128 and let us assist you in making the right choices for better health. Ask about the AutoShip program for additional savings. That number is 888-442-2128. We're back, everyone, learning all about the olive leaf. Isn't this just amazing? But before we go on, I've got a little announcement for you. I've got to let you know it is special savings time at BioInnovations. Best prices of the season, fantastic prices, and free shipping on orders over $50 in the mainland USA, so a great time to get all the nutrients you need to stay healthy. Well, Richard, now you have some interesting information about olive leaf and its antioxidant properties. Yes, the, the first question we always ask, are these special agents found in our foods? Do we actually absorb them into our bloodstream or they can have this uh, speculated event, uh, effect? And we find from research reported in molecular nutrition and food research. Yes, olive leaf components, they are absorbed and they do enter into the human cells. University of Milan found that olive leaf prevents the oxidation of cholesterol plaques. These are the plaques that become inflamed 
they break loose in the coronary arteries and they plug the artery and you have a heart attack or if it's in the neck here it can lead to a stroke and it all comes begins with the laying down of these cholesterol plaques trying to soothe an injury to the artery. They become inflamed. It attracts macrophages that inflame the area even more. And they eventually they break loose and cause the number one cause of death in America, cardiovascular disease. Well, they have now at least 11 studies confirmed that olive leaf's antioxidant ability, and this would be true of all olive products, olive oil, olive leaf, and the olive fruit. They're very potent antioxidants and very convincing of the Mediterranean diet's effect in preventing heart disease. The Mayo Clinic recently did a study and they found two to three tablespoons a day of olive oil lowers inflammation enough and reduces endothelial dysfunction enough to prevent heart disease. Two to three tablespoons of olive oil a day. Now remember, olive leaf has 10 times, 10, 10 times the amount of antioxidants as the oil without the calories. Now I want you to use olive oil. It's very important because the oleic acid, the oil component, provides health benefits. But take the olive leaf with it as well and keep the calorie count down. The University of Madrid, Madrid, four to six tablespoons of olive oil a day reverses coronary artery disease definitely add some olive leaf extract to that. Here's the power of the Mediterranean diet. Here's the power of the olive leaf and the olive tree, the, the fruit and the oil, all of it, olive products. Let's just call it olive products. This is profound. This is what we're missing. Now, those of you, I think I have your attention on that with uh, cardiovascular disease, but you're saying, well, olive oil is a premium product. It is so expensive. But would you rather pay your heart surgeon or pay your grocery bill? Because it really, it comes down to that. Now, wouldn't you rather avoid the disease altogether? Because there's no 100% cures of anything, right? right. I, I, I get so frustrated when people, well, I can't afford that. And then they'll go right down and fill $500 worth of prescription medicines and not even blink because their insurance pays for it. Meanwhile, they're paying $1,000 a month health insurance premiums, and where do you think that goes? To pay for those medicines. I, I get so frustrated when the answers are right here. They're right here. Iranian study. Olive leaf protects kidneys from antibiotic-induced kidney damage. This is gentamicin, doctors, nurses, you know all about this. Poisons, you know, medicines are poisons, let's be honest. And they can damage this, the gentamicin, although a powerful and in last resort medicine, it can save lives, it can also damage your kidneys. They found if you gave the lavatory animals the olive leaf extract, no damage to the kidneys. It was amazing how much it spared the kidneys the damage of gentamicin. That's the powerful antioxidant activity. Turkish study, olive leaf protects genes from oxidative damage from promethean pesticides. Have you, anybody in your family had scabies or pedunculosis, lice of the head, and the doctor gives you a promethean shampoo or something for the skin, and then he says, now be careful, not too much, it can cause seizures in children and even in adults if you're very sensitive. The pesticide, the promethean pesticide, is very effective in killing these pedunculosis, as they're called, but there's a, there's a dirty underbelly to it. It's that free radical load on the brain that can cause seizures, and that can be terrifying. Well, they found in laboratory animals, olive leaf completely prevented those seizures. That's powerful information. Now. I tell you this not so that you can go out and slather on promethrin and be immune from seizures. It's to help you understand that the free radical load that our brains endure every day from the toxins in our environment is the reasons why we have Parkinson's disease, degenerative neurodegenerative disease, Alzheimer's disease, the heavy metals, the pollution. All of this is a free radical load on our brains. And these antioxidants protect us from these things. That's why I tell you, not so you can slather promethrin all over your body. Does that make sense? I hope it does because this is powerful knowledge. Uh, in laboratory animals, olive leaf antioxidant protected against stroke. When you pinch off an artery, it takes longer in a laboratory animal of no blood flow to cause a stroke if you give them a dose of olive leaf. Olive leaf protects pancreatic cells from oxidative damage. If you have recurrent pancreatitis, please get on olive leaf extract, curcumin, grapeseed extract, probiotics, and you're going to get better. Now, I can't promise you it's a cure, but the studies say you will have fewer attacks, you will have less pain if you get on an antioxidant program. And you can take it with your medicines. There's not a problem there.
Olive leaf and hypertension. Let's do this before the break. This is the one agent we have that reliably lowers blood pressure. 500 milligrams will lower six points. A thousand milligrams of olive leaf extract a day will lower it 12 to 13 points. We have four, five studies now, identical twin studies. Over and over, olive leaf extract is outstanding for blood pressure control. Now let's be smart about this. With our olive leaf, we take our vitamin D. We also take our high potassium diets, fruits and vegetables, because as potassium levels go up, blood pressure drops. Do we really need to take four, five, six antihypertensive medicines when we need vitamin D? We can use the olive leaf and these other natural measures to keep our blood pressure down and daily exercise. Olive leaf and blood pressure. Don't forget that one. It's capable of saving a life. We have a break. We'll be back. You may have heard the saying, an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure. It's true. I'm Dr. Richard Becker. And I'm Cindy Becker. Autumn is a time of transition. It's the perfect time to renew your dedication to healthy living. This September, we're excited to bring you our fall savings celebration here at BioInnovations. Perhaps you've heard about the health benefits of supplements. In many cases, they can make a big difference. During September, Dr. Becker's Spa Nutrients are up to 40% off. Noni Natural Skin Care and Spa Therapy are 40% off. And Aloha Noni and Acai are still 50% off by the case. And you get free shipping with orders over $50 in the continental U.S. This is a good time to restart a program of nutrition, exercise, and supplements because an ounce of prevention really is worth a pound of cure. Order online or call 888-442-2128 and let BioInnovations assist you in making the right choices for better health. Ask about the AutoShip program for additional savings. our hope for you today. I'm Cindy Becker. Do you feel that you'll never really be joyful and happy in your life? The Reverend Billy Graham wrote about these two emotions, joy and happiness. Dr. Graham says, joy is not the same as happiness, although they may overlap. Happiness depends on circumstances. Joy depends on God. In Psalm 30, David, whose life seemed an endless battle, experienced joy despite his problems as king of Israel. David wrote, you turned my wailing into dancing. You removed my sackcloth and clothed me with joy, that my heart may sing to you and not be silent. If you are struggling to find joy in your life, pray to God, count your blessings. Joy depends on God. I'm Cindy Becker. This is our hope for you today. For centuries, the herb astragalus has been a staple of traditional Chinese medicine. It's used to create a strong shield, protecting the immune system. Astragalus is also used to support healthy heart and lung function. There's even more. Astragalus helps to calm total body inflammation, a common cause of pain and chronic illness. All of that without the use of medication. That's right. Support your health the way nature intended with astragalus root. BioInnovations brings you Dr. Becker's Bionutrients Astragalus Root Extract. BioInnovations is the affordable source that you can trust for all your vitamin and supplement needs. Give us a call at 888-442-2128 or order online at bioinnovations.net and see what Astragalus can do for your health. That number once again is 888-442-2128. Ask about the AutoShip program for additional savings. Call today. We're back. A quick reminder, everyone, it is special savings time at BioInnovations. Fantastic prices. I mean, really good prices. And free shipping on orders over $50. Of course, that's the mainland USA, but a good time to get what you need. Okay, Richard, time is short. I know we yes. have so much to do on so Olive much. Leaf. However, it is really good for the hypertensive patient it as is. well. And many health experts agree hypertension is the number one health threat in America. And our, you know, our growing waistline and weight gain, all this, it all drives us, our sedentary behaviors, it all drives hypertension. And we have studies now, British Journal of Nutrition, even one dose of olive leaf extract 
counters endothelial dysfunction. It makes the arteries soft and pliable. Just one dose. Now that's a limited effect, but even with one dose, you'll see a drop in your blood pressure. University of Indonesia found that olive leaf extract, 500 milligram equals captopril, 12 and a half milligrams taken twice a day. 12 systolic, five diastolic point drop. That's just one capsule of olive leaf in the morning. Uh, that's it. One 500 milligram. If you need more, Take a little more. Take two capsules a day and we can get even a little more. Olive leaf and inflammation. Methotrexate and methotrexate alone. Rheumatoid arthritis. Methotrexate is a very powerful anti-inflammatory drug. It helps rheumatoid arthritis, but there are a lot of side effects. This study found that if you take methotrexate with the olive leaf, you get far better results in early rheumatoid. When rheumatoid has been allowed to go a long time, there's really nothing that reverses it. But if we can get to the rheumatoid patients early and counter this autoimmune surge of antibodies that destroys the joints, olive leaf is a very good place to start. Also, the autoimmune inflammation associated with the onset of diabetes type 1. We reduce that inflammation. See, all of these things triggered off of the Mediterranean diet. Those who eat like the Mediterranean people do, they have lower rates of rheumatoid, they have lower rates of diabetes, lower rates of autoimmune disease, they have lower rates of coronary vascular disease, they have lower rates of cancer. Why? Let's figure that out, scientists. And this is the result of those studies. Olive leaf in pain, it's a good analgesic. Olive leaf in cancer, let's put it this way. Olive leaf is fundamental in cancer therapy. It helps to lower the side effects of chemotherapy lowers the side effects of radiation therapy. A recent review of antioxidants in cancer therapy, 499 studies reviewed. All of those studies but one, and the one that didn't show a benefit just so negative. It wasn't negative, it was just nothing different. But 498 out of 409 showed a benefit to the cancer patient. Not one of those studies showed harm to the cancer patient using antioxidants in cancer therapy. And oncologists, please, stop telling people to stop taking antioxidants. You have no basis in fact for that statement. I have 498 studies that say I'm right. You've got none that say you're right. Please review the literature. Be objective. People's lives depend on it. I, I just, I would take the antioxidants anyway. That, but that's how I am. I have a higher degree of confidence. I've been studying this all my life. I want to impart that confidence to you. Multiple test tube and animal studies. We need more human studies to be sure with olive leaf, but we have activity against hepatocellular cancer. That's primary liver cancer. Cancers of the prostate, cancers of the lung, breast, colon, and kidney, oral cancers, leukemias, glioblastoma, malignant mesothelioma, that's a new study that just came out, and melanoma. We need direct studies in humans to gain confidence for everybody. Perhaps one of the most remarkable benefits of olive leaf extract is what it can do for the diabetic. Multiple studies lowers your long-term glucose levels, that's your hemoglobin A1C, lowers fasting insulin levels, it delays starch digestion and absorption, and it improves glucose hemostasis, meaning it manages your blood glucose levels, and it helps to reduce the damages done by high glucose levels through its antioxidant activity. This is a brand new study. Remember how we've talked about how grape seed extract and resveratrol stimulates the sirtuin, the thinness gene? Guess what? Olive leaf does the same thing. Olive leaf extract, frontiers in pharmacology. Olive leaf extract activates the sirtuin thinness gene, reducing inflammation, fat, and lipid accumulation while increasing thermogenesis and lipid metabolism. In other words, what that means is this gene turns on and it takes the fats in your diet and uses them to burn heat and not deposited as fat on your body. It turns the physiology of an overweight person into a thin person, and the studies show in six, eight weeks, you can have the physiology of a thin person if you take resveratrol, grapeseed extract, olive leaf extract. You don't have to do them all, choose one. Any of them will do that for you. That is just remarkable. And keep in mind, these powerful antioxidants help to counter the advanced glycation in products of high blood sugars. The pickling effect, the damage to the nerves, the damage to the blood vessels. These are the driving forces of the complications of diabetes. Olive leaf extract helps to prevent those, helps to prevent those. Other, osteopenia, 
Here's, this is a brand new study. This is amazing. 250 mil, that's a half a capsule a day. Led to increased bone mineral density and reduced serum lipids. Also, they found that it inhibits the enzyme known to drive osteoporosis. People who eat the Mediterranean way have lower rates of osteoporosis. America has the highest osteoporosis rates in the world, but we consume the most dairy products. The answer is not in drinking more milk. It's taking more antioxidants and antioxidant rich fruits and vegetables in your diet. And olive leaf turns osteoporosis around. Add to that a little magnesium. Magnesium builds bone more dependably than calcium. Pretty amazing stuff, isn't it? Do you know how bad people suffer from... Can you imagine turning over in bed and breaking ribs? Your bones are so thin and they hurt just as bad as when you were a kid and they were really strong. People need help with osteoporosis and olive leaf extract. Wound healing, 87% improvement in wound healing. I, I could go on and on. We don't have the time. When we return, let's talk about who would benefit from olive leaf and we'll tell you how to take it when we return. You may have heard the saying, an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure. It's true. I'm Dr. Richard Becker. And I'm Cindy Becker. Autumn is a time of transition. It's the perfect time to renew your dedication to healthy living. This September, we're excited to bring you our fall savings celebration here at BioInnovations. Perhaps you've heard about the health benefits of supplements. In many cases, they can make a big difference. During September, Dr. Becker Spa Nutrients are up to 40% off. Noni Natural Skin Care and Spa Therapy are 40% off. And Aloha Noni and Acai are still 50% off by the case. And you get free shipping with orders over $50 in the continental U.S. This is a good time to restart a program of nutrition, exercise, and supplements because an ounce of prevention really is worth a pound of cure. Order online or call 888-442-2128 and let BioInnovations assist you in making the right choices for better health. Ask about the AutoShip program for additional savings. I'm Cindy Becker for Your Health at a Glance. We all have said, I need to get some exercise, but how many of us put on our walking shoes and go? Learning a little more about the health benefits of exercise may help you get motivated to lace up those walking shoes. Exercise helps to control our appetite and weight. It maintains strong muscles. It promotes the release of endorphins that counter depression while helping us feel good about our lives. Exercise helps to lower blood glucose, promotes a strong circulatory system, and controls cholesterol. Exercise even helps us get a good night's sleep. Recent research finds dog owners who regularly walk their pet are 34% more likely to achieve fitness goals. You can get all of these health benefits by walking 30 minutes four times a week, just 30 minutes a day. Start today and you'll start to get all those benefits. For your health at a glance, I'm Cindy Becker. CoQ10 and L-carnitine are among the most important nutrients our bodies use for energy production. Deficiency in these key nutrients can cause serious complications to your health. In fact, statin drugs that are used to lower cholesterol may deplete your CoQ10 levels. Bioinnovations brings you Dr. Becker's Bionutrients CoQ10 with L-carnitine. Now providing support for cardiovascular health is easier than ever before. CoQ10 and L-carnitine support a healthy heart naturally, as nature intended. And our formulation provides 300% greater absorption of CoQ10 than similar products, using a technology so effective it's patented. Bioinnovations is the affordable source that you can trust for all your vitamin and supplement needs. Give us a call at 888-442-2128. That's 888-442-2128. Or order online at bioinnovations.net. Your Health is brought to you by Bioinnovations, trusted products for your health and well-being. We're back, everyone. Just a quick reminder, it is special savings time at BioNovations. Fantastic prices and free shipping on orders over $50 in the mainland USA, so don't miss it. So, Richard, tell us quickly, who would benefit yeah. from taking olive leaf extract as it, part of their nutritional plan? Uh, that's a very good question. Anyone interested in health maintenance, and we all should be, and disease prevention, anti-aging, 
You want to maintain your youthful appearance for as long as possible? Is there cardiovascular disease, coronary artery disease, peripheral artery disease, uh, hypertension, stroke, any of the vascular diseases, please, uh, olive leaf, and add olive oil to your plant. You know, it's heat stable. That's a misguided notion. You can fry with olive oil. It works. Cancer, cancer therapy uh, helps prevent side effects and complications. Diabetes, infectious disease. You know, it's one of our best natural antibiotics. That, that and uh, oil of oregano, olive leaf and oil of oregano, two very powerful natural antibiotics that should be in everyone's spice cabinet. Let's put it that way. Kidney disease. Diabetes associated kidney disease, hypertension associated kidney disease, please consider it. Candida, yeast, intestinal dysbiosis, chronic sinusitis, allergies, olive leaf, gold star. Gold star. Primary, reliable, and no resistance to date. Amazing benefits. Chronic viral syndromes, shingles, chronic uh, Epstein Barr virus, the mono. Uh, fibromyalgia type scenarios that may be driven by chronic viral infections. These double-stranded DNA viruses that get in us and stay in us for our lives. And when our immune systems drop, they re-emerge and take over and give you chronic fatigue and shingles and things like that. Epstein-Barr virus, uh, all of those. Uh, um, olive leaf extract helps to suppress these viruses. What else? Uh, variety of skin conditions, including psoriasis, pain syndromes, gout. Uh, um, uh, olive leaf extract inhibits xanthine oxidase, the enzyme that makes uric acid. So it's your natural alternative to the gout medicines. Very helpful. Respiratory conditions, allergies, sinusitis, hypertension, cardiovascular disease, uh, diabetes, chronic viral syndromes. We did that. You know, these are the conditions that drive America to the doctor painful conditions. Uh, we didn't mention it in our outline, but we have a minute here. Olive leaf extract, they've actually been able to prove that it slows the degeneration of the cartilage in the knee joints. So when you combine that with the concept that it helps to preserve bone mass, see these degenerative conditions where the knee joint slowly essentially dissolves away leads to severe pain. It leads to knee joint replacement, but you know what else it does? It puts you in a chair, and you're no longer able to get your exercise, and you know what happens when you're in the rocking chair all day. The end is not far away. These are the agents that help keep you moving. It helps to preserve joint function and bone strength so you can move about with less pain. That's a tremendous benefit. See, all these benefits started with the observation of the Mediterranean diet. Look at all the differences in health outcomes when we eat healthfully like the Mediterraneans. How can we make this easier for people to do? Hence, all the research on olive oil, olive leaf extract, and olive fruit. Take advantage of this knowledge. It's just tremendous. You know, quite a program today, a lot of information, and you stuck in there with me, and you learned a lot, didn't you? Thank you for your kind attention. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye, everyone. Thanks, everyone. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. In watching Dr. Stanley all these years, he's still speaking the truth about hearing the voice of God and obedience. There's nothing added to it. There's nothing that he's taken away. It's just truthful. And then it's Dr. Stanley, and he is an amazing communicator. There's just no nonsense there, and that's what I love about him. You know, he's very honest about who God is and truthful, and that's essential in the world that we live in today. Join Jim, Lori, and the Baker family every day for prophetic updates. These are Revelation Days. Inspirational ministry. We need to stay alert. We don't live yes. in fear. We live in faith. And powerful teachings from charismatic ministers, prophets, and influential figures.